A local high school robotics team will be representing Buffalo on the global stage. They're heading to Houston for the World Championship competition. And the team showed News 4's Kayla Green some of the tricks they'll use to win it all. Team Electric Mayhem from Nichols School built this robot in just eight weeks, and their hard work is paying off. We've worked really hard on this robot this year, so I'm excited that we can show it off um, to everyone else in the world who's made it to this competition. This isn't the first time they've made it to Worlds, but for seniors like Ben Robert and Emmy Franz, it hasn't been able to happen since their freshman year due to the pandemic. They've been practicing the game they'll play at Worlds with their robot. There's a autonomous period where it has to be completely self-controlled with code and from there it collects it picks up giant tennis balls from the ground and throws them in a funnel then it driver controlled so you play three on three with uh, two other robots on your alliance and then you keep throwing the balls in trying to get as most, most points after the ball game the final part of the competition is for the robot to climb the monkey bars this team climbs to the highest bar for bonus points The team also competed in two regional competitions over the past few weeks, winning the highest award in both. But the team's awards mentor, Mo Elhel, says it isn't only about the robot. Only one team at each event is um, given this honor. It's the Regional Chairman's Award. It really derives from community impact. And it's a sign of a well-established program that is truly making a difference. The students on the team say it'll be tough to win worlds among 600 of the best teams across the globe but they say the experience is a win enough. That process of collaboration is really important to learn how the real world works, and that's sort of what we learned this year. This team is like my second family, so really, I know we've put in so much effort, and to see that payoff is really just incredible. The team heads to Houston for the competition on April 20th. In Buffalo, Killer Green, News 4.